ओके वी आर सींग द टॉपिक हियर इट इज मैट्रिक्स इज अंडर दैट रैंक ऑफ मैट्रिक्स इट इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक इन दिस मैट्रिक्स सो वी आर डिफाइनिंग द रैंक ऑफ मैट्रिक्स हियर एज रैंक ऑफ मैट्रिक्स ऑफ ए हैविंग द ऑर्डर एम क्रॉस एन दिस एम डिनोट द नंबर ऑफ रोज एंड डिनोट द नंबर ऑफ कॉलम्स इज सेट टू बी अविंग रैंक आर कब इफ देर एग्जिस्ट एट लीस्ट वन नॉन जीरो माइनर of the order r and all the minors of the order r plus 1 and onwards are zero then we say that matrix a will have a rank r now what does it mean we'll see by the definition uh, sorry by the example so symbolically the rank is denoted by the rank of a or it is row of a now i have taken a matrix a as it is what 1 0 2 053 okay now i will find out the minors for this the highest minor that that we get from this matrix is 2 by 2 so that i collect here 1005 1005 1005 now minus means it is a determinant okay minus is nothing but a determinant so this we calculate here 1 into 5 0 into 0 it is coming to be the 5 which is non zero now this is non zero and this is the minor of the order what is it 2 and therefore the rank of this matrix will be it is what 2 according to the definition now Uh, so we can say that the value of r which is rank it is 2 here and now all the minors of the order r plus 1 and onwards should be zero we will check that r plus 1 ka matlab kya hoga jaise ki maine 2 plus 1 kiya that will be 3 so minor of the order 3 wo kaise hoga humko milega we are having the matrix 2 by 3 i just add one zero row i will get the minors of the order 3 and now if you calculate this determinant where one row is zero so the value of the determinant is what it will be zero because by the property of the determinant if any column or if any row is zero the value of the determinant is always zero now if i calculate or find out the minor of the order 4 by 4 i will add the zero row and the zero column so that i will get the new minor of the order 4 by 4 that is again all uh, uh, having the value it is what zero so jitne bhi higher order ke minor yahan pe aa rahe hain that is coming to be the zero here okay so it is satisfying the definition that is we are having a minor of the order 2 which is not zero and all the higher order minors are it is zero therefore the rank of this matrix will be it is what 2 now next example i am moving here where i having a matrix of the order it is 2 by 3 okay so yahan pe aapko fir se hum yahan pe higher order minor kya la sakte hain 2 by 2 so that i have taken here now i have taken a cross multiplication this 4 minus 4 it is coming to be the zero matlab pehla minor to zero aaya aapka at least ek minor aana chahiye jo non zero rahe तो इसलिए मैं सेकंड पॉसिबिलिटी देख रहा हूँ फिर वन टू थ्री सिक्स लेके कि ये जीरो आता है कि नॉन जीरो आता है क्या बट इट इज ऑल्सो जीरो थर्ड पॉसिबिलिटी दे सकती है मैं सेकंड और थर्ड कॉलम लेता हूँ इट इज टू थ्री फोर सिक्स आई फाइंड आउट द माइनर फॉर दिस अ वैल्यू फॉर दिस माइनर एंड दैट इज अगेन जीरो सो ऑल थ्री पॉसिबिलिटी वी हैव टेकन फॉर टू बाई टू मैट्रिक्स फॉर दिस मैट्रिक्स ओके वी आर ऑल पॉसिबिलिटी फॉर द माइनर एंड ऑल आर कमिंग टू विद जीरो Now we are going to the lower order minor. अब lower order minor कैसा होगा This is of the order टू by टू So lower order क्या रहेगा वन by वन So I take वन by वन as it is determinant of वन I take the first element and it is वन which is non zero. So minor of the order वन which is non zero. Therefore the rank of A is what वन At least वन minor should be non zero. So यहाँ पर हमारे पास दिख रहा है कि this is non zero then it is rank is वन और इसके हायर ऑर्डर माइनर हमने अभी चेक किए ऑल आर इट इज जीरो थ्री बाई थ्री भी जीरो रहेगा फोर बाई फोर भी जीरो रहेगा दैट इज ऑबियस ओके सो दे फॉर द रैंक ऑफ दिस मैट्रिक्स इज वन नाउ वन मोर थिंग इफ ऑल द एलिमेंट्स ऑफ दिस मैट्रिक्स आर जीरो देन व्हाट विल बी द रैंक डेफिनेटली इट विल बी अ जीरो बिकॉज इट विल बी अ नल मैट्रिक्स इफ यू फाइंड आउट द ऑल द माइनर्स ऑफ द ऑर्डर टू बाई टू वन बाय वन थ्री बाई थ्री ऑल विल बी इट इज जीरो दे फॉर द रैंक ऑफ नल मैट्रिक्स इज ऑलवेज जीरो आई हैव लिस्ट आउट द प्रॉपर्टीज हियर that is rank of null matrix is zero then rank of non singular square matrix of order n that is n is uh, of the order n is it is n jaisa agar example hum dekhte hain we are having a matrix of the order 3 by 3 i calculate the determinant value for this and it is coming out to be minus 8 which is not equals to zero okay now and this is the we say that the matrix a is then non singular matrix अगर डिटरमिनेंट का वैल्यू नॉन जीरो आ रहा है तो मैट्रिक्स को नॉन सिंगुलर मैट्रिक्स कहते हैं एंड इट इज हैविंग द ऑर्डर व्हाट इज इट थ्री देर द रैंक विल बी इट इज व्हाट थ्री व्हिच इज हमने यहाँ पे बोला रैंक ऑफ नॉन सिंगुलर स्क्वायर मैट्रिक्स ऑफ ऑर्डर एन इज एन नाउ नेक्स्ट थिंग 
uh, one more thing if a is a null mat a is not a null matrix then rank will be greater than equals to 1 now uh, we are having this matrix actually uh, okay if it is not a null matrix we have seen null matrix is, uh, is having a uh, rank what is it 0 agar null matrix nahi hai to definitely uska rank ek to 1 rahega nahi to 1 se greater rahega it is obvious thing now after that uh, we take one more example of the order 3 by 3 this is the fourth one uh, we are having this is the matrix of the order 3 by 3 i find out the determinant for this okay determinant for this will be this 0 so the highest determinant we are having that is highest minor the value is 0 so we are going to the lower order minor that is for 2 by 2 so 2 by 2 ko humne pehla liya and that is coming out to be what it is minus 10 which is non zero hence we say that the rank of this matrix is what it is 2 because we have uh, uh, there exist a minor of the order 2 which is non zero and higher order minor that is of the order 3 by 3 and 4 by 4 all are it is zero so this is by definition we have seen that is how to find out the rank there is one more method to find out the rank that is called as the row transformations method so here i am written the one more thing here elementary transformation whether it is a row transformation or a column transformation do not change the rank of matrix this is the important property now what are the elementary row transformation and the column transformation we'll see here column transformation kya hoga it is we can interchange the two columns the second is i can multiply any column with the non zero element a is not equals to zero i can change the column as one column added to the multiple of other column that is ci plus a times of cj these are called as the elementary column transformation similarly we are having the elementary row transformations that is we can interchange the two rows we can multiply the one row by the non zero element or we can change the row as a ri plus a times of rj that is one row added to the multiple of other so this we can do in the row transformation and this transformation do not change the rank of matrix so we are having one uh, shortcut method that is we convert a given matrix into a upper triangular matrix okay and then we decide the uh, that rank will be decided by the number of non zero element in the that upper triangular matrix so now if i see the one example here we are having this upper triangular matrix upper triangular matrix means diagonal ke niche ke element zero so we are having here this is the principal diagonal niche ke element zero dikh raha hai paas okay now if i write down the one thing here it is what three so this is the upper triangular matrix we are having now here the what are the number of non zero row it is three now uh, zero row means what is it if all the element of the row are it is zero then it is called as the zero row so number of non zero row it is one two and it is three therefore the rank of this matrix is what what will be it is three okay now one more thing i just change here i make the entry here it is what zero if i make the entry zero here now again we are having upper triangular matrix is it but what we can do here one more thing we can do i can make this element zero by using this one i apply the operation r3 changes to r3 minus r1 so zero minus zero zero minus zero one minus one that is it is coming to be the zero so number of non zero row here it will be what two so after getting the upper triangular again it is possible to reduce the one row as a zero row so we are converting that into the zero row then count the number of non zero rows that will give the rank of matrix so here the rank of matrix for this will be it is what two agar pichla wala example dekha tha wahan pe agar hum ye operation lagate hain to ye non zero ban jata hai fir okay so therefore the rank for this will be it is three but agar main yahan pe zero leta hu then i can reduce this row as a zero row so number of non zero row will be it is what two so this is the short method to find out the rank of matrix that is we convert the given matrix into the upper triangular and then later on we count the number of non zero row okay after getting the upper triangular if it is possible to reduce one row as a zero row so hum usko reduce karenge uske baad then we count out what is it number of non zero row that will decide the rank of matrix so we have seen today that is rank by the definition and the rank by the upper triangular concept okay this you have to remember thank you